today on CWN. Have you signed up to give blood? Are you an FCA? And do you have yearbook finds? I'm Katie. And I'm Haley, and you're watching Cow Allen Wildcat News. Good morning, Hello in High School. Today is Monday, May 1st, 2017. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and the Pledge to the Texas Flag. The Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. If you've had excessive absences and oh, attendance hours, stop by the counselor's office to pick up an attendance appeal form. They are due no later than Friday to the attendance office. And seniors, you have until May 19th at 4 p.m. to complete all makeup hours or you will not walk the stage. And you will need to report back to school for the week after graduation. And here's Erica with today's giveaway. Thanks, guys. This giveaway is brought to you by the Baseball Booster Club. Today's question is, what was April de Giraffe's calf's name? Be the first to call 7702 with the correct answer to win. Back to you guys. Seniors, if you have an up if you have an unpaid yearbook or senior ad balance, you are now on the fine list. So please pay your balance to Miss Jimenez in full. Generation Texas Day is a spirit day to build awareness of college enrollment. To celebrate all students and fa faculty are encouraged to wear a college or military shirt or ball cap. All seniors wearing their college shirts will take a group picture during homeroom in the gym on Friday. Our last blood drive of the year will be held tomorrow, so sign up outside the cafeteria during lunch today. And now on to sports. Here's Michael. Thank you guys and good morning Wildcats. Sports is brought to you by Texas Driving School. Our baseball team is now second place in district after their losses against Moody last week. Good luck in playoffs, boys. Now let's check out their highlights. Congratulations to Brooke Barrington on an incredible track season. After many injuries, Brooke ran her season, ran her season best and placed fourth in the region. Great job, Lady Cat. And Alexis Saki got first place in discus and shot put at last week's track meet, and she's headed to state. Great job, Saki. The Lady Cat Booster Club will have a meeting tomorrow in the library at 6 p.m. And to all Lady Cat athletes, invitations have been mailed out for the banquet on May 18th. You must RSVP by May 12th if you plan to attend. Calvin Powerlifting will have their banquet on Friday at 6.30 in the cafeteria. Stop by room 201 to grab your tickets. That's all for sports. Back to you guys. The Art Club had their car wash last week and check it out.
If you are unsure about what career to pursue, sign up in the College and Career Center for, career for the Career Fair on May 11th at the American Bank Center. Space is limited, so turn in a permission form as soon as possible, and they're due. The FCA meeting tonight has been canceled, but they will be hosting a spring late night on Friday from 9 p.m. to 2 a.m. in the A-Gym. Tickets are $5, and you can buy one from any FCA officer. And I'll have the weather outlook right after this short message. Ladies, y'all aren't supposed to be on your phones. We need those back, thank you. You can get them from the office later today. Oh, let me have the headphones, too. Thank you. I'm really glad you had yours put up. All right. All right, guys, today's weather is brought to you by Great Balls of Ice. All right, right now we're looking at sunny skies and a temperature of 64 degrees with winds out of the southeast at 5 miles per hour. All right, in our regional radar, you can see there's maybe a few scattered showers just out here in this area of the Gulf, but not but too far away for us to get anything, any activity today. Thank you, guys. As you can see right now, uh, yeah, now we have some clear skies. Well, winds coming from the south at 4 miles per hour. Right now, it's 71 degrees out here. Let's hope, it, let's hope it gets better throughout the day. And that's all for me, and I'm back to you. Thanks, JC. All right, moving on throughout our day, we should see sunny and clear skies throughout our day with temperatures of 82 degrees and temperatures of 86 degrees, going all the way down to 76 degrees tonight at 8 o'clock with winds out of the south, southeast, and southeast for much of our day. All right, now on our United States radar, we do see this line of showers right here over the east coast, just about over the east coast. That was from that cool front that hit through last week, and we should see another cool front in the west that will move into our area starting on Wednesday evening. All right, now on Tuesday, we should see partly cloudy skies with an 86 degree high and winds out of the southeast at 20 mi 25 miles per hour. On Wednesday, we should see increased chances of rain at 60 percent and an 86 degree high. And on Thursday, we should see partly cloudy skies with 83 degree temperatures. All right, guys, that's all for your weather. All right. And that is all your announcements for today, but now it is time for your joke of the day. So, Katie, what kind of shoes do frogs wear? I don't know, Haley, what kind? Open-toed. <laughs> <laughs> and, of course, for all you social people out there, make sure you're following us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat, at Kyle Allen TV for all the latest updates. Also, subscribe to us here on YouTube to catch all of our latest videos. And, as always, stay, stay classy, Kyle Allen. Allen.